Welcome back. This is my makeup look that I'm wearing today. Keep watching if you want to see how I got this look. And of course, as always, you can check the description box below for a list of all of the products that I used on my face today. So to start off with, I'm going to prime my face and I'm just using the Hangover Setting Spray by Too Faced. And then for my foundation, I'm going to use the Bye Bye One by It Cosmetics. I'm going to put just like, start with like a half of a pump on my brush, blend this out onto my skin. The brush that I'm using today is by It Cosmetics as well. It's the Airbrush Blurring Brush number 101. And I'm dragging it like down my neck to just like a little bit past my face just to make sure everything's all seamless, you know. I really like this foundation. It's so just like natural, like skin-like looking, but it has really good coverage and it blends out really easily. And now I'm going to add on some concealer. This is by BH Cosmetics. It's the Cos Cosmetics, Cosmo Cosmetics. This is by BH, Cos BH Cosmetics. I can't pronounce any worse today, apparently. Um, this is the Studio Pro Total Coverage Concealer in the shade 100. I'm going to set all of the cream products on my face with the RCMA Loose Powder and this fluffy brush by Eco Tools. I'm going with just a really fun, just like bright pink look today. I'm going to add on some bright pink blush. This is by ColourPop, one of their little heart-shaped blushes. The shade of this one is called Text Me. So we got some nice blush on. I also put a little bit on the tip of my nose, just like that. And now I'm going to grab an eyeshadow brush. I'm using this little fluffy blending brush and I'm gonna dip into that blush and I'm going to put this in my crease. Also blending this on my lower lash line with that same brush. So I've got a little bit of pink on the eyes and now I'm going to add in, this is a liquid like eye shimmer. It's by e.l.f. It's one of their molten liquid eyeshadows. These are no longer sold, I, but I have quite a few shades of them so I wanna like use them. But this one's called Brush Copper. It's kind of just like a sparkly gold, like a light gold. And I'm going to just put a little bit of this on my lid and then blend it out with my finger, kind of tap it in. And then over top of that little bit of liquid shadow, I'm going to use this one that I have. This is called, the brand is called M Princess. I don't remember where I've gotten this from. I've had it for a while and I just rarely ever reach for it because it's a single, like it's sort of a loose shadow, but it's really pretty. It's like just like a sparkly kind of rose gold one. So I'm going to take this with my finger as well and just pat it on top of my lid. And I'm also like dragging that into my inner corner as well so I get some highlight there. For my face highlight, I'm gonna use this fan brush by Morphe and I'm going to apply this one by Ofra. It's called Moon Dance. A little bit on top there, about like that. Put a little bit on my nose as well and also like my cubist bow, maybe a little bit on the forehead. Okay, I filled in my eyebrows and now I'm going to take this little brown liquid liner that I have from e.l.f. This shade is called Coffee and I'm going to draw on a little bit of a wing at the end of my eyes. Just like a little flick. Okay, I got my little wings and now I'm also going to use this brown liner to just draw on some tiny little like lashes on the bottom. Just a few little lashes, extra lashes there. And now I'm going to add some setting spray. This is the same one I used to prime with. I'm using the Ofra highlighter again and a little tiny brush to add on some brow bone highlight and a little bit more on my inner corner too. So for my lips, I'm going to start by lining them with this lip liner by NYX. This is the Suede Matte Lip Liner. I love this liner. This one is in the shade Vintage, which I've never tried before. Okay, so I filmed them in and I'm also, I also like um, filled, no. Let's start that sentence over. I lined them and I also filled them in like most of the way on the inside there. And now I'm going to go over top of this with this um, Slick Click Lip Balm by NYX as well. There's the click. This one is in the shade, this one's a pink shade, it's in the shade of Thriving. And now over top of that for some more shine, I'm going to go in with this Fruit Lip Oil by Sophia and Mabel. It's just like a clear, like a sheer pink one. And then our last step is some mascara. This is Urban Decay's Perversion Mascara. And here's the completed makeup look. I really hope that you enjoyed watching this video. If you want to see more content from me, I post twice a week, most of the time on Mondays and Thursdays, but sometimes on Mondays and Fridays. So if you want to come back to my channel, I have plenty more makeup videos to choose from. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!